Boxing Ego here. If you like this video, make sure you hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon on the top of your screen to get notified when the latest new content drops. One. Canelo Alvarez is looking good at the middleweight division. What up, Fight World? It's your boy Ego, and I'm back with some more boxing. Make sure you smash the like button. Also, subscribe to the channel for the latest and greatest in boxing. If you want to become part of the gang gang notification gang, please hit the bell icon. Shout out to the super chats, the channel donations, and the Patreon patrons. Now, I'm back with my original segment, Ego Weight Watchers, aka Ew. Why I give you guys a look into the fighter's lifestyle before, after, progress, pictures, especially when they have a fight coming up. Now, a fight we all know about. September 16th, it goes down. T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas. Canelo Alvarez. I was born ready versus Gennady Golovkin. And you see in the clip at the beginning, Canelo Alvarez actually looks better to me at this particular weight. He's training. He's showing a little bit of his routine. I was looking on his social media, made some videos about it, but he's getting up early, 5 a.m., probably eating something light or taking a, like a snack or whatever, and he's already out running by 6 a.m. And I like this kid's work ethic, man. I think Canelo's a hell of a fighter. Golovkin's a great fighter also. And there could be only one. We're gonna see who, who comes out. But for me, Canelo looks good at this weight. Even though he's shorter than a lot of the guys in the division, the Daniel Jacobs, the Jamal Charlo, those would be difficult fights for him. I still see him, he, he kind of looks better to me at this weight. I really believe from seeing the the pictures and the weigh-in from the Chavez Jr. fight up to now, I think Canelo, like it has me convinced that Canelo was killing himself to make 154 for the Liam Smith fight. He looked miserable on the scale, even though he, he did his thing in the ring. I think 154, 155, it was it was about time that he moved up because to me, he looks more natural. Even like I said, even though he's not the tallest guy at middleweight, he looks more natural here. His speed is still there. He has tremendous hand speed, slow feet, but he, he just looks more comfortable to me at this weight division. And there was a lot of indications of this when they were when Canelo had the WBC and even when Golovkin had the WBC, they would weigh about the same for the 30 day mandatory weigh ins. So that was an indication that they probably could have fought before, even last year, because they're about the same size in term not height wise, but in terms of uh, body mass and, and weight. Because like I said, the 30 day weigh ins, they were weighing roughly about the same if, if you look at when they both had the belts and the WBC does the mandatory 30-day weigh-in so this should be a good fight I'm looking forward to it I want to see how Canelo deals with the height length and jab of of a Gennady Golovkin and I want to see how Golovkin deals with the hand speed combination punching and in the brains Canelo doesn't just have the brawn yet he, he has the brains also and he knows how to put together punches and he knows how to finish guys and also be smart. I think Canelo has a better defense. So I'm really looking forward to this fight. I did a video earlier. HBO is doing a special it's called Under the Lights. Check that video out. Max Kellerman, Roy Jones with Canelo and with Golovkin. So I'm looking forward to that. Ego Weight Watchers, let me know what you guys think. What does Canelo look like? Do you think his speed will be there? His power will be there? Some people have questions on Canelo's power. Is it true power? Abel Sanchez kind of um, brought up the fact of like, who is he KO? He didn't KO Floyd. He didn't KO Edison Lada, Miguel Cotto. So Abel is doubting that he can knock out. And it sounds like even hurt his fighter, Gennady Golovkin. I want to know what you guys think. Ego Weight Watchers, drop your thoughts in the comment section. Make sure you smash the like button. As always, hate, comment, and subscribe. Till next video is Ego signing off. So if you enjoyed this video and want more content like this on the channel, you can show your appreciation by going to the PayPal donate button or the YouTube support button. And you can donate any amount that you feel is equivalent to the value of this video. Much more to come. Thank you guys for your support. Boxing Ego the future of boxing.